We don't shake very well. <laughs> <laughs> What's banging cosplay mafia? T Dragon here, and today I'm with Holly Wolf. What's up, everyone? Yeah. And today we have come together to talk about one thing that is very important to men and women all around the world boobs. Wonderful boobs! boobs. Yay! Ah! But boobs in what context? How amazing they are, and how it's so silly when people have problems with boobs, especially with female cosplayers, and how awesome they are. And if they want to show some cleavage, who cares, yo? Anime characters are crazy, yeah. and they have giant boobs. So we want to, like, you know, try to get bigger boobs for cosplay, mm -hmm. or just pad the shit out of our bras. Who cares? Hashtag cosplay is for everyone. It is exactly because we all love boobs. <laughs> First off, boobs are just amazing. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, boobs are awesome. People shouldn't have a problem with them. Who doesn't love boobs? I love boobs. I love boobs. My favorite, like, anime characters, like, comic book characters, they're all stunning. Yeah. So, I mean, we're trying to, like, make ourselves look like that and embody these amazing characters. And they all got nice boobs. Some have nice boobs, some have smaller boobs, some have pecky boobs. They're all beautiful <laughs> and have their own characteristics. They all need to be appreciated for what they are. They're like their own entity. And they feel good. Boobs. They do! They're soft and squishy, Jigglypuff? just like Jigglypuff. Yeah! <laughs> Jigglypuff! Jigglypuff! Yeah, Jigglypuff! <laughs> boobs being so amazing, cosplayers of all kinds and variations have boobs, and we want to just talk about that to you guys. Yeah, I feel like sometimes there's some serious hate upon female cosplayers, especially the more cos-famous ones. And I hear a lot of the times people being like, oh, she's only famous because yeah. she has a pair of boobs. There are so many female cosplayers, so I feel like we all have boobs, exactly. so we should all be equally famous. But the thing is, these girls that maybe they have bigger boobs than others, girls like Jessica Negri and Yaya Han, they got giant boobs for sure, but they're also amazing, amazing artists. Mm -hmm. Their craftsmanship skills are out of this world. <laughs> they're like so good at what they do and they love it as well. Yes, they have boobs, but they've got a lot more going for them than just that. So I feel like these people that hate them just because they have boobs should probably get over it yeah. just a little bit and appreciate what they do. You gotta stop hate and make love. Exactly. Why you gotta hate against boobs? What are you, Ben Gay? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like the cosplay community as a whole is like really, really cool. So those people that, you know, are have a little bit of a minority that bring up the trouble for it. It's enough to affect things in a bigger Why way. Why you do this? Yeah. Why you do this? Spreading negativity. Nobody wants that. We just want to love. And we just want to cosplay our like favorite characters. Yeah. And if they have massive boobs, hey, why not? can't watch Kill a Kill and be like, I, I can't rock this cosplay without the boobs, you know? Yes, and speaking of Kill a Kill, like there's some cosplayers lately that, that made like those prosthetic boobs. Yeah. So I mean, instead of getting a boob job, which not everyone can afford, and even if they do, good for them. For instance, I have a boob job, because I had, I had nothing, I had nothing before. So I really wanted one, and I'm so happy that I did. But people also do like these crazy like prosthetic pieces for their chest to cosplay these characters that may have a hell of a lot more going for them in this area. So it may be very eye-catching and awesome, but they also put a lot of work into making things like this, and I totally respect that. And for those who paid for a boob job and spent that money, yo, that's a lot of money. But yeah, if people want to change their body, change something up, make them feel more confident about themselves, who cares what it is? To me, it's like when a guy wants to get ranger fit and he works out to freaking be the buff guy. Living Ichigo is a great example. He's here too. Yeah, he's here. If you want to look the part of your character from that show, you just have to go all out and do it. Yeah, and, and being fit's awesome. Cosplaying and, and trying to improve your body and be fit, you're, you're getting healthier for something that you love. It's like it's like two in one. Vegan life. That's vegan what life. <laughs> Yo, if I could be vegan, if cheesecake didn't exist, I could be vegan. Summary, boobs are awesome. Don't hate. Yeah, don't hate. Don't discriminate. <laughs> Hashtag cosplay is for everyone. Do you, because only you can do what you can do. Exactly. I would just say love people of all sizes and shapes. And really I want some cosplay can. Thank you guys for watching so much. Holly T. Wolf on the Instagram and the Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and uh, yeah, I have YouTube too. You can watch her videos right here. Yay! Yeah. 
You can watch my other rant videos on the side here, and also my music videos over here. You guys let us know in the comments down below. <laughs> Do you like boobs? Do you like big boobs? Do you like small boobs? Do you like bums more? Maybe you like bums. What about girls that squat like crazy to get a nice ass? So they oh yeah, what about that booty? Short <laughs> shorts, you know? I'm all about that too. You gotta have a nice bum to go with those boobs. <laughs> If you like the video, subscribe for more. Check out Holly T. Wolf's channel. She's dope. So guys, remember, like always, stay beautiful, stop hate, make love, and earth, water, fire, air, I declare it, I think you swear. I can't do that It's a snow day here in Texas, and I'm with my dog, Akira. Akira, what do you think about boobs? You like boobies, Akira? That's a big maybe. But either way, hey, she's indifferent about boobies.